Hi everybody. This is um, kind of going to be several items um, on this video. First, uh, you know, I've, I keep looking up recipes for homemade gesso. And what happens is either the person who's giving the recipe um, uses something I don't have, and I like to use what I have, or I don't know, something else. So I'm just going to, this is Johnson's baby powder, and I'm just going to put a bunch in. so that I can make some homemade gesso. Now, I know that if I run out of this, I can use baking soda too. I think it's that's it. Um, or maybe it's the other one. I don't know. So, um, that. And then, I've, um, I've watched people, you know, if you have kids around making slime, you can't just, you can't just have a small bottle of glue laying around for them to use because it won't last. So I just broke down and bought a gallon. So I've got a gallon of Elmer's glue here. And I'm just going to put some in because I, honestly, I don't know how much it will take. So we'll try that. One more glob. There. <laughs> there we go. So I'm just gonna try that. And then in order to have white gesso, uh, let's see, where did I, where did I put the white? The white paint oh yeah this is that titanium white that is kind of heavy body and the truth is I'd really like to get rid of it it's real nice paint I just don't know sometimes the heavy body works out just fine and sometimes it doesn't so I'm just gonna put some of that in that should be good And then I'm just going to, I'm just going to mix that up. Let's see. Ooh. Kind of liquidy. I don't know. I may not need any water. But the thing that I've heard, heard said about homemade gesso is that it's a, uh, it's lumpy. And so I want to make sure and get the lumps out to begin with and uh, if I can and so I'm just gonna try to do that yeah it does smell good the baby powder makes it smell good Yeah, it's, it's really soaking it up now. And the, ba the baby powder <coughs> um, ingredients, it doesn't exactly <coughs> say, but I could look them up, I guess. <coughs> so calcium carbonate <coughs> is what I think it is. <coughs> Excuse me. <coughs> I might just have to go get a drink of water. I think I got some of the baby powder in my throat. So now that's pretty thick. Sorry. 
I'm just going to go get some water. Someone else that I know of, uh, I watched added a, a spoonful of Mod Podge, and I do have Mod Podge as well, but I'm just going to see how this works out here for now. And I'm just going to, I'm going to set it aside for a moment and try to let it soak into the let the baby powder soak up the liquids before I put in the water. So, set it aside. Now, this was, these, you know, I just can't leave things alone. I just needed to put more on the ATCs for, for Lizzie and then after that, that's okay. And then you remember the bigger one, the tag. Well, um, <clears throat> this is gonna. This one I meant for. Okay, where's where is the? In all of my mess, I'd like to distress the edges of that if I can find the well I'm just gonna I'm just gonna go on with the rest of it and then when I'm done I'm gonna I'll find the distressing because I know that it did not sprout legs and walk out and this is the gold metallic paint marker. And oh, I love it. And I'm just going to finish up this tag. Oh, so, um, you know, if you guys, if you get tired and really don't want to listen to the, the latest medical report, you know, I have no problem with that. Just fast forward past that part. And, and skip it. I just appreciate everyone's everyone watching and all your support I need to spread these out a little bit so I just wanted that to have a little maybe I'll just do this too yeah I don't like that I think I'll go ahead and distress it when I do find my distress ink. Okay.
So then, I'll let that dry for a minute. Then on the backs of these, I'm gonna want to, I'm gonna wanna put some gesso on the backs of these. I hope I don't mess up my work. And then when that's dry, I just can put these little ties back on. just want it wet damp I mean I don't I, I don't want it drippy wet so I'm gonna try this now and it's it's really thick so I'm not sure I think maybe I should add some water nice and opaque you know except for these really dark areas really fun kind of like Playing chemist. And as it sits there, it's getting a little thicker because I know that it's probably soaking, the uh, baby powder is probably soaking into the liquid part of the glue more. It wouldn't take a whole lot for me to make texture paste out of this because it is really thick. And up until now, I have used the Dollar Tree. I call it the Dollar Tree texture paste. It's really, um, I'll have to grab it and show it to you.
know, I do just work pretty slow. It's just, I don't know, it's just my way. I, I've always been slow. <laughs> I was, uh, I mean, not intellectually slow, <laughs> but slow to process things, slow to get things done. I was, I was running a race at school and I was really proud because I was the fastest of the slow ones. <laughs> and I know that's sad. My dad was watching. He, he picked me up on days for visitation and in those days divorce was un, pretty much unheard of. So he didn't walk on campus, you know, or make himself obvious at all. He was, he was, uh, yike, yike, yike. He was sensitive to that. I'm making a mess on my own ATCs. I'm going to have to fix that one with this white stuff. I should have done this white stuff first. This gesso. So I've never tried this before. Okay. Yeah, I messed it up. Sorry. I'm just gonna turn this over because I don't wanna What's happening is I'm laying the ATCs where I painted the backs of other ones. And they're picking up the paint or whatever, gesso. Okay, we'll just try this one now. So the thing is, if I'm gonna send them off, um, unless I know for sure that the person is completely loving the whole recycling, repurposing, reusing um, idea. Like Maggie in New Zealand, she loves that. She sends me her things. We don't ah, we don't send each other things because it's so expensive that often. But I absolutely love to get things from her. And you'll see the back of it was a package. How about that? Okay, there we go. You can see. I'll have to fix it. <coughs> that one's okay. <coughs> <coughs> Sorry. So I did go to the, I thought, uh, to the pulmonary specialist for the last visit. And I, it's true, I did not sleep at all during the last uh, sleep study. How do you lay there and not sleep all night? I guess they were. I guess they were talking about it in the office that someone actually 
did not sleep. And that was me. That one's okay. This one's a little bit not okay, but it, it I can, I might be able to pass with that. Okay, um, I've got a lid. And so I'm thinking that I will be able to blow dry this and I hope I can get it dry. So I'll be right back. So now that I have the ATCs with the gesso on the back and this one, I just want to put some, I'm not sure how, how I'm gonna do this. I mean, it seems plain, so I would just like to put one more thing on the front, and I think this is real pretty. Like that. But then, I don't think that these will, this one will be needed. It's okay the way it is, kind of. Let's see. I just think I'll put a little glue on that. That's okay, I guess. I don't know, to me this seems like either out of place or overdone, I'm not sure. So I'm gonna think about that for a minute. And then uh, this is for, this is for Spanky in her group. <clears throat> Let me see. I'm looking for my pens. And everything is always missing. So her her word her word for her um, promotion, I forget what it's called, challenge, is, um, I can write it right down here. And I should have written it here too, but I didn't. Okay, it'll come to me. <clears throat> like when I'm off camera and then I'll write it on and then I'll put it in the description. So thank you for watching. And this is a also a um for Spanky Spanky's Corner, Spanky Madison, her YouTube channel. She has just uh recently gained 500 subscribers and that is Amazing. That is awesome, Spanky. Congratulations. If you don't know Spanky, go over and subscribe to her, watch her videos, and give her some thumbs up. 
and be um, be aware that she is um, just an awesome. She's an artist. She's just everything I've seen her do is great. So um, with that, I'll say talk to you later. And thank you for watching. Bye-bye.